Hey everyone, TechnoMentor with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to sync your apps between your iPhone and iPad. Now let's get started. So in order to sync anything between your iPad and iPhone, it has to share the same Apple ID account. It has to be shared through iCloud. So first thing is in your setting of both the devices, make sure you're using the same Apple ID account. As you can see here, I'm logged into the same Apple ID account. Now from there on, first thing is if we're going to sync apps from your iPhone to your iPad, we need to go into our setting of our iPhone iCloud account or the Apple ID and click on it and then click on iCloud and you'll see here apps using iCloud we're going to click on show all and it's going to list all of the apps and data that can be used with your iCloud that can sync on your iPad so if you scroll down here a little bit further you'll see a bunch of apps they should all be green that you want to sync and then if you go to a little bit further down you'll see the apps themselves that you may have downloaded that might have data that could be synced with your iPad. So we need to go ahead and turn these on or select whichever one you want on. So if you want some and you don't want other, leave them off and you just go ahead and click on it. Now keep in mind, although you are uh, saving this data on iCloud here, you still need to go ahead and download the same apps if you don't have it on your iPad here as well. So you'll need to go to the App Store and download those apps so they can sync. And then from there on in your settings, same exact thing, Apple ID, click on iCloud and make sure you're using your iCloud and then where it says apps using show all you'll also need to turn it on here so if something is turned off here and it's turned on your iPhone it's not going to sync so you need to turn that on so both of the devices have to have the same app turned on in apps using iCloud and they'll start syncing and that's how you sync apps between your iPad and iPhone I hope this video was helpful if so please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone iPad and other iOS devices see you guys next time